My dear fellow listeners and viewers, today I would like to take the opportunity to, rhyme, to remind you of the things you can do to empower yourself. There are a lot of things you can do, but I'll keep it very simple. I'll share with you three things um, that you can do, all of us can do for that matter, to empower ourselves. And the first thing is to find our passion. You want to dig into yourself. I've kind of said it in different ways before, but now I'm kind of simplified a little bit here. You want to find your passion, whatever that may be. Whether it be cooking, whether it be love for animals, whether that be IT related, you know, food, entertainment, um, whatever that is. You want to find that passion of yours. And once you find that passion, you do not want to sit another moment. You want to act fast and act quickly to move forward with it. Because a lot of the times, we know what we want, you know, we figure out, you know, of the things that we are very good at and always, um, you know, um, you know, wanted to do and all of that, but we are not doing anything with it. And that's a huge problem. So once you find your passion, number one, find, um, you want to act and act quickly because you know best as to what it is, you know exactly how you want that thing to be, how you want it to look, um, you know, you know exactly where you would like to take it, you know, five years from now. All of those vision, you have all of that um, already. You just cannot think about it. You have to act. So once you find your, your passion, you want to act and act quickly. And the third thing that you can do to empower yourself is to make sure you stay positive regardless of how challenging the situation may be. Because there's no question that when you're working on anything, any project, whether that be you working on it on your own or with other people, there are going to be stumbling blocks, meaning that um, it wouldn't, um, you know, always go exactly how, you know, you hope for it to be. Um, things will come in the way. There are going to be disappointment. There are going to be, you know, probably death in the family. There are going to be financial issues. How do you get started? There are going to be people, actually, and they're, um, you know, who might not see the vision that you have. And people might discourage you. People might say that, what are you doing? <laughs> you know, why are you wasting your time? All of that. So you have to be very positive. And, um, but keep in mind that if you believe in something, nobody can stop you because only you can understand what it is. You only you understand what is it that you're hoping to do. Only you can understand your own ability, your own strength, and your own vision and all of that. So that's my message here today. Three things that all of us can do to empower ourselves. And I'm going to re uh, remind um, you very quickly. One, find your passion whatever that may be, to act on it very, very quickly. And um, three, stay positive regardless of how challenging it may be. So thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. My name is Narayan Datsukram. Wishing you a great today and even a better tomorrow. I'll talk to you soon.